Hi, this is Steve Haas again. In this video, we're going to talk about connecting to a premium SMTP service. In this case, I'm going to use uh, SendGrid as an example, but really all of them pretty much work the same. First of all, you're going to have to sign up for a free SendGrid account. So you can click this button right here on the uh, SendGrid.com uh, sign up page for free and it'll show you the different plans and so forth and then you just click on start for free and I'm inside of my uh, SendGrid account and I'm going to go ahead and add the uh, web API and SMTP relay okay that's what we're going to use in Sendio so as you can see here we'll click to start with Sendio and the uh, SendGrid interface so back to SendGrid, I'm going to give it a name and I'm just going to put it Sendio example. And I'm going to create the API key. And this big long string right here is the API key that we're going to need. So we're going to copy that string and all this other information. I'm going to just copy it to a notepad. so that I have it right in front of me while I'm adding it. You can do it whichever way you want. You can just copy directly from the website or in the notepad. Anyhow, back to the Sendio interface here, and we're gonna give it a name, and again, we're gonna call it Sendio Test. Sendio. I'm gonna call it SMTP, and mark it SendGrid. And the username, as you saw here, is API key. So we'll copy the API key, go back to Sendio, put it in there. And then we're going to take that long string, the API key that we just generated here. We're going to copy it. And we're going to paste it right here. Then your from name obviously my name is Steve Haas and from email now this is important because you do not want to use a free service like Yahoo or Gmail or any of those you want to use something like from a domain so in this case I'm going to go ahead and use Steve at attentionsoft.com that's it I'm going to hit save And voila, it's there. So it's set up. It's ready to go. You can see it in my uh, manage my accounts. And that's really as hard as it is. All of these APIs work the same. Right now, there's only three, I believe. Uh, let me go back and double check that. But currently, as I'm creating this video, we have support for MailJet, Amazon SES, and SendGrid. Over time, we'll be adding more. But even still, you don't really need to have this because you can still use the SMTP interface as we did before and just add the information the same way. So if you have a premium SMTP provider and you don't see it listed here, just go ahead and use the uh, SMTP uh, setup like we did before in our previous uh, videos. All right, that wraps it up for this one. I'll see you in the next video.